they will be creating a new port scanner so create a new file name it as a port scanner open it so here we will be writing our codes and the first thing we'll be do we'll be doing is that we'll we are gonna need some file so that's why we'll be typing require socket require timeout So this is another tutorial guys mind that and this is creating I'm quit I'm writing the code in Ruby so yeah <clears throat> I've got some really bad nose. Whew. So that's it. This is your first port scanner now. So you need to download Ruby in order to run the program because on the EX you can run on every single computer. So yeah. If you need help, you can just contact me. So IP address www. This is the website of my school that I used to read before, and it'll take it'll take about ten seconds to scan a single port to be here. So let's wait. So I can't really pause the video, so that's why you should wait. And you can see here, there is only a stop button on this desktop capture thing. Really great so port 19 is closed port 20 is op closed port 21 is open 22 is open hmm. no, 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 no. 23 is closed So basically what is happening here is the program is just I mean re receiving sending and receiving information from the website so in order to do that it needs something a program that it needs some a file that will help it connect get to the internet so that's why we at the first place we typed in require socket and so after it has required socket now what it needs to do is it need it needs to it needs a file oh no so yeah that was it that was it you just saw you know that was it. so that was it and let me just explain a little to you so this will just help the program to connect to the internet this will just helps the program to know that how much should it wait so if the port replies under 10 seconds it will declare the port as open but if the port doesn't replies under 10 seconds it's 
it's known as closed. It is declared as closed, so that's why. And the port is, is scanned from 1925. And yeah, that's it. It will scan, it will sleep for four seconds. And yeah, thanks guys. If you have any problem with this video, you can just contact me. Thanks and peace.